Yo guys, what is up? This is Nick. We are back on XCOM. Uh, we are we have the council mission portent, so that's what we're going to be tackling today. Uh, I think we're all set Excellent. out. We look forward to seeing your progress. All right, what that nickname do we want for Yennefer? Um. Uh, I'm gonna make her her nickname Vengaberg. I don't even know how to spell that. It doesn't really matter if I spell this right. Well, I'll spell it right. Let me see. Where's my phone? Here we go. I did spell it right. All right. Oops, I, damn it, I hit the wrong button. <laughs> I hit the center console button instead of start. I wasn't looking at my Xbox, or my, my controller. There we go. So that's her nickname. I still haven't figured out. Tris might just have, I don't know. I, I, there's not really a hair color for her that matches. So for now, she's just going to stick with that. I'll figure out what I want to do. I'm probably just going to give her the hat with the, with the radio headset thing. I think that's pretty much the easiest. Dropship has arrived. All right, let's do this. France is sending an urgent mission request. All right, investigate the area of operations, locate and secure any survivors, survivors as well as the convoy's cargo. Eliminate any opposition. Okay, so this is the mission with the guy who doesn't want to talk. He's like part of the, he's part of what you might call it. Um... There's been widespread speculation about this ambush on a French military convoy, but we don't have much to go on. Our primary concern is the Council Intel report indicating alien activity in the area. We need to secure the site but... and look for some clue as to what happened here. Objective update. This is uh, this is the dude that. Um... I'm on it, Commander. That is part of Exalt, but he doesn't want to talk. I think that's that's this guy. I'm doing it again, though. I'm splitting my troops up into groups. It's kind of just what I do. Oh, we found an enemy. We got one thin man on the roof. He jumped off, so he's no longer on the roof. 50% chance I'll take it. Well, good, yep. Okay, let's move her rookie up to here. Roger that. Overwatch. Gonna push everybody in here. Get them set up to go. Put her right there. We'll call the turn. Okay, let me put let me throw Siri on this on door. Oh, uh, come on, on there we go. We'll throw Triss and Yennefer up against this they door. And I'm gonna move Kira. I can get her to the cover there, so that's where I'll move her. Found an enemy. Okay, let's pop this door. So this dude's dead. Guarantee the kill. 59% for Triss. Money. Good shit. He's down. Alright, let's move our rookie. Let's move him up to I'm here. On the move. On Overwatch. 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 Pop the door with Siri. Overwatch and Overwatch. Those bodies don't look like they've been hit by alien weapons fire. These men were killed by conventional bullets. Alright, where... Here's Kira. I want her to get moving up to... Do we want to go around this side of the tank? I think I want to go around this side of the tank. 
I'm gonna put put this Ready dude up location. on the tank. Weapons hot. Oh, I found an enemy. And he's on the roof now. That's horrible. 53. Take it, recruit. Yes, recruit. Nice shot, rookie. Got him. Didn't have the advantage because he was up higher. Still was able to drop him. Let's see her up. Nothing yet. All right. I feel like they'll be safe here, kind of off to the side. Which is what I'm gonna work with. So, well, they won't be in cover, but I I, I like that location. Um, it's kind of off, and if anything shows up, they'll have a clear shot at it. All right, let me put Siri onto the onto the building. I'm gonna put Reed up here. I'm gonna put him back here, uh, because I know what's coming. Kira's gonna be the one that I use to go and get this the operative, the uh, exalt guy. Okay. Let's get them up. Let's get them. Huh. I'm gonna put them in here on different cover. Okay. Put her in here. See if we set anything off. Nope. Only have cover right now. It's all right, but it's all we're working with. Everybody overwatched. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this turn to get some reloads. Because once you make contact with the dude, no, I put her in the wrong spot. Son of a gun. I have to move her back. That's issue. That's errors I can't be making in this playthrough very often. Sensors still indicate life signs in the area, Commander. New objective received. Reload. All right. Let's get Kira on the move. When you love us. Have her overwatch, overwatch, overwatch. That's affirmative. Eyes peeled, overwatch. Commander. Her to here. And overwatch. Commander, it looks like there's still someone alive over there. If we can bring them in for questioning. Maybe we can figure out what happened here. Okay, where... Let's keep moving Kira slowly but surely up. Roger that. Scanning. Making Roger sure to that. keep her covered. Alright. Get her up to here. This will be her final move before she actually makes contact with them. We should try to reach that survivor if we're going to get to the bottom of this. What do you think I'm trying to do, Central? Okay, let's get him. Might as well leave me here. <laughs> I have nothing to say to you people. It looks like he's the only witness to survive this fight. And for all we know, he was one of the aggressors. We need to bring him in, whether he likes it or not. We have a new objective. Um... I'm gonna move the survivor... back here. As well as I'm gonna move Kira away from that thin man. Just play it safe. They start dropping on roofs and stuff like that here real soon. We're picking up new contacts moving into the AO. Okay, come on, Tris, hit him. Damn, yes. Wait, what? Okay, I was gonna say what? We hit. I thought. 
I hate that spot. My guy's not gonna have a shot. Son of a bitch. He will have a shot on this guy, though. He's dead. He's gotta die. Well, yep, there we go. Sniper shot money. Alright, so we got this dude on the roof. 50% chance. Can we throw the grenade up there? We cannot throw the grenade far enough up there. I'm gonna take the shot. Yes, we have been money this mission. But he shoots your life. On Overwatch. We are the beginning. We are money it's this mission. <coughs> okay, dropping people back. Like a four. On the Just dropping everybody back in a unit now. Now it's Eyes on the prize. now I'm set up. I like the setup that we're in. Good stuff. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Oh, it just switched. Okay, I'm not sure what the game is doing. Overwatch. Aye, aye. Okay, next. You're nothing but a bunch of puppets. All right, here we go. I didn't know what was going on there. That's affirmative. That's affirmative. Drop that. Let's go there. Let's take him and throw him up on that tank. I'm gonna dash Kira all the way back here. Where is there we go. This is a waste of time. I'm gonna put him on the tank in the center. Eyes on the prize. Got it covered. Yeah, my son, come on. There we go. Scanning. Heads up out there. We've got hostiles on the move. Okay, so we got a drop. We got one drop on the roof. We've got another drop on the roof. Yen should have a shot. No, she. Yeah, she does. Okay. She's off the mark, but she still took a shot, which is fine. Okay, come on, there we go. Guys have been money this mission. I will say that. Um, hmm. I'll put her right here, I'm gonna block. If the sectoid wants to come down, it's gonna have to jump. I think that's what I want to do here. Put Siri up here. I've peeled, Commander. Come get some. Put Kira in there. Just trying to get sight so that uh, when we do see the sectoid, he won't have a he won't have a chance. And there he goes. So here we go. Reed, come on, buddy. Yes, nice shot, rookie. I'm about to start keeping score. All right, so I'm gonna just dash. I'm gonna dash Kira back. I'm gonna dash him back. And I'm gonna dash this dude all the way to here. What are you trying to prove? Alright, and then I'm just gonna overwatch the rest of these guys. Strike one. We've got hostile contacts moving on your position. Oh, come on, Siri. Oh, that looks good. That looks good. Yes, money. The money shot. Alright, so... I'm just gonna haul ass with this dude. Oh, I can't get him to the evac zone. So he's gonna go there. Roger that. Okay. There we go. Let's move her to here. Moving. Her to here. And I'll move Yen to the doorway here. I think that'll work out well. I'm just overwatch everybody. Okay, it looks like that might be it. Now, where is the. Here he is. Get in there! You're still not getting anything from me. 
Excellent work, right. Commander. Our friend here might be uncooperative at the moment, but I have a feeling a talk with Dr. Valen will change his tune. But, uh, nine alien killed, zero operatives lost. No damage taken, even, so... I would say it went well. Alright, back to base. Impressive okay, work, yep. Commander. Our soldiers have to be feeling good after a mission like that. Look at all the the all the promotions. So she got up to lieutenant. So we got two lieutenants. Now we've got three. We've got a corporal. Sorry, we have. So I'm able to get the three med kits going with her. Kira plus five defense or plus ten critical chance per enemy in sight. I'm gonna go with the defense. And then we got this new guy. This is this is gonna be Zoltan. Because I'm going to turn him into a mech really soon. Uh, and so, let's see. We got some decent stuff. Not a whole lot, but not too bad. So we got one engineer, one scientist, and $150. Remember, we will be watching. Ugh, cybernetic slab is done in zero days. Alright, let's go ahead and get the cybernetic slab complete. Okay, let's go ahead and the augment. Who volunteer for mech trooper augmentation sacrifice much, but they do not leave themselves entirely behind. A mech trooper will be able to apply some of the training and knowledge from his or her previous combat specialty to the cybersuit's operation. With this facility, we'll be able to build mechanized exoskeletal cybersuits, or mechs, and implant our soldiers with the cybernetic interfaces they'll need to deploy these mechs onto the battlefield. All right, so let's go ahead and augment him. We'll consult with Dr. Valen for the requisite amputations and begin installing the cybersuit interfaces as soon as possible. All right, um, let's see here, build and buy items. Uh, I don't need any of those, okay. Let's see if I can get anything in the officer training school. Rapid recovery. Okay, I'm gonna end up get I'm gonna get both of those, so we're almost done with the officer training school already. Pretty early, and I think it's worth it. Alright. Augmentation is done. The cybernetic interfaces are holding stable. But they're of no use without a cyber suit to interface with. I suggest we manufacture one immediately. When our new mech trooper equips that suit, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised with its capabilities. Alright, so, soldier augmentation complete, let's go to the mech inventory. Uh, soldier, da, 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 da. alright, let's build the first mech. What do I want? Flamethrower, kinetic strike module. I'm gonna go kinetic strike, uh, that's more for late game than right now. Right now, most beneficial is the flamethrower, but the kinetic strike is better late game. Because it does a crap ton of damage, and near the end of the game, there's a, enemies with a crap ton of health. So I'm going to take it. I guess I could build a suit with just the flamethrower and then switch, get a new one with the uh, kinetic strike module later on. That's not a bad idea. But I don't... Yeah, we're just going to go kinetic strike. Mech is online. Alright. I buy anything for my mech? I don't think so. So we got $18 left. Not not very much money left, but let's go ahead. We'll get the satellite uplink underway. All 
Alright, new satellite uplink. Satellite uplink complete. Let's carry on. Carapace armor in three days. There we go, assign new project. So we got carapace armor. Um, I'm gonna get Siri her laser. I'm gonna go precision lasers and get that for her going. And let's just continue scanning. Contact detected. All right, scramble the interceptors. We're in pursuit. Come on, there we go. So there is an alien crew moving at the crash site. So head back to base. All right, so it's going to be Sky Ranger time. We've got Zoltan here. We need to customize, but first he's got collateral damage. I like that ability. Give him his mech suit. The kinetic strike module is a powerful yet precise weapon. It can provide a decisive advantage in close quarters and remove the benefit of cover from our enemies. But yeah, so this is Zoltan. So let's go ahead and name him. I'm not going to be using him until I get Geralt all squared away. I still need to get uh, his him all set up. I need to get a heavy a heavy male. I guess is what I'm saying. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's see here, what color should we give him? I'm gonna go with a green. I think we'll go with a green for him. Let's just go with the solid green. So, facial hair, let's give him a beard. You can't give him a beard. This, fa this facial hair is weak. Okay, we'll just go with that, I guess. We'll go with that colored hair. Alright, that'll work. That'll work for Zoltan. So we're not going to be taking him out though here at the beginning. I still need to get Geralt all squared away. Is it Nico a guy? No, it's a girl. Son of a gun, dude. Do I not? I don't think I have any. I think this is my last guy. Kirill Vorobayov. Vorobayov. Uh, we can rename Triss. I'm just going to make her nickname Marigold, which is what, uh, what's his name? Uh, Vesemir calls her. Which is her last name, obviously, but that's his nickname for her. All right, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Let's give her the headset. Let's give her the radio headset. Where is it? There we go. So I think that works out well. Uh, but that's going to do it for this episode, guys. In the next one, we will be taking our squad and heading out um, to check out the alien craft we shot down. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you all then. Peace out.